you, ma'am, for your kind words. Moving on, ladies and gentlemen, we will now move on to the most awaited section of today's evening, and that is our Academy Awards. So, to start with, I would like with the introduction of the jury. I would request Mr. Gokul Krishnan to come up and introduce Mr. Vishal Menon. Uh, good evening, everyone. As a film critic, Mr. Vishal Menon has covered numerous Tamil, Malayalam and Hindi films by writing analysis pieces, interviews and columns for the Hindu English edition. Apart from writing about films, he is currently actively involved in working on an ambitious social media project to document the architecture of 100 movie theatres of Tamil Nadu. We are happy to welcome you, sir. So if you would like to have a few words. We would like to go on to the next jury. I would request Mr. Pranav from First Year Editing Department to please come up and introduce Mr. Satyaraj. Good evening, everyone. Mr. Satyaraj Natarajan is a renowned editor in the Tamil film industry with many notable films under his belt across different genres, such as Kalyana Samayal Sadam, Video Moon, Orumodal Orukadal, and Valiba Raja. He also happens to be an alumnus of this very film academy, so we are glad to have you back, sir. Next, we have his venture to look forward to called Super Deluxe, of which he's not just an editor, but also the executive producer. We welcome you, sir. Yeah. We now, we please request you on stage, sir. We now request Mrs. Kavita Prasad to present the bouquet to Mr. Satira. Could please say a few words. Thank you. Uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, like uh, 10 years ago, uh, I was sitting here. Uh, I don't know what my future would be like, uh, but now I am in industry and uh, I could, uh, like, I am in a position like uh, uh, where uh, I, I don't have words to say, but uh, it, uh, it, it's a great pleasure to uh, being in the uh, being in the Prasad Academy. I, I I would like to thank Mr. Prasad sir and Kavita Prasad ma'am and everyone uh, in the academy uh, because uh, without them uh, I, I wouldn't be here. So. Thank you, everyone, and uh, best of luck for the uh, newcomers and uh, uh, guys who are passing out today. Thank you. Now I would like to request Ms. Ayushi Anil from First Year Sound Department to please come up and introduce Mr. Surya Narayanan. Good evening, everyone. Uh, Mr. Surya Narayanan is a national awardee for his work on the film Mahanadi. He played an important part in introducing digital sound to Indian cinema. He also is the technical head at Cube. He has designed a lot of audio studios, theatres and cinema theatres. He has worked on few international albums and also has collaborated with the topmost music directors of this generation. He is also an alumnus of Adair Film Institute. We are very proud to welcome you, sir. Uh, Miss uh, Kavita Prasad, ma'am, to like, uh, give the bouquet to the... Javed Sahak to present the momentum. I would request uh, Mr. Surya Narayanan to uh, say a few words. Thank you for all the people to make me come here. Thank you very much uh, giving this opportunity for me. All I would say is uh, Great organization, fantastic organization. The day I left out of the Film Institute and came, I was, you know, dreaming to come here and work. I was actually, you know, uh, uh, was fascinated with the people, great visionary people. Um, I saw the f students' film. They're also great students. Good job done, actually. The kind of, uh, it shows how much of it is this academy giving to them to make things. No, I, I, I'm seeing that very clearly. Thanks. Thank you very much for the 
you know, all the efforts to make this academy. And thank you to all the people to are, you know, making uh, this academy a successful thing. I'm really proud to be associated. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Our next jury. Mr. Vijay Karthik has been unable to mark his present today, but I would request Ms. Shraddha Kasturi to still come on stage and introduce him. Good evening. Mr. Vijay Karthik has handled the camera for movies like Darling 2, Rayapuram 13, Kalki and the upcoming film Irva Kalam. He's also worked on A.R. Rahman's Netflix concert film One Heart and music video for the song Abhija. Another music video he worked on was for the Hindu Tamil called Thai Engel Tamil Nadu. He's also done various ad films for major brands like ITC, Amazon and Bharat Benz. Now I would requ request Mr. Nimish Poirkar from first year direction course to please come up and introduce our last jury for today, Mr. R.S. Prasanna. Hello sir. With this fresh and unique way of writing and directing stories, Mrs. Mr. R.S. Prasanna gave us two heartwarming movies. The Tamil film Kalyan Samayal Sadhan and remade it in Hindi as Shubh Mangal Savadhan. He was recently featured on Rajiv Masan Director Roundtable and was even nominated for the Z Cine Awards for the Most Promising Director. He also happens to be an alum alumni of our film academy and we are glad to have you back, sir. Can I please request you come on the stage? And I'll also like to request Mr. Mrs. Kavita Prasad to, to present the book here. And I'll request Javed sir to present the momentum. Yeah, so I'll... It's a big honor to be on the same stage as uh, Javed Saab. So, I, I, I'm sure he's tired of hearing such adulation, but sir, you are such a personality. So, we have to show our respect to you. Good. So, <laughs> you know, which is more than what you can say for most of the films which release outside. You know, so all films are good, but some were exceptionally good. And uh, when you receive the awards, some of the films may have been very fine points difference here and there and uh, so bear in mind that uh, but for the rest it doesn't matter <laughs> and uh, what matters is that this is the beginning of your learning and uh, you have like Javed Saab a person here who's going to inspire all of us that uh, you know cinema is an endless just we did thank you for calling us as a jury it's a great honor to be coming back to this place which is my mother and without Ali Prasad, there is no Kalyana Samal Sadam or Shubh Mangal or Tumkha. Now finally, I'd like to move for the grand movement, for the awards announcements. We would like to start with the sound department. The first award for the sound design, Bronze. q and A's in my life. And my experience is that the first two so, uh, questions come with a great hesitation. And after that, everybody has two questions. <laughs> Actually, uh, I have two questions. <laughs> okay. Tell me the second one first. No, no, I will tell you. Yeah. So, my name is Manoj Bane. Uh, I am from Mumbai and I am a sound designer. Uh, so, to me, Lagan songs are like a masterpiece. Uh, in those songs, uh, lyrics have a very visible and uh, significant, significant contribution, both uh, aesthetically and uh, cinematically. Uh, so, I want to know about two points. The first point being, Lagan's lyrics are something which doesn't have any influence of Urdu in it. And uh, it's out and out rural Hindi. So, what did you feel writing in such language when new millennium was about to begin. Did you feel uh, doubtful about acceptance of such songs? And the second point being, uh, being a hardcore atheist, how were you able to get that sense of devotion in the song uh, O Palanhari in Lagan? Personally, I preferred the first part of the question, which was complimentary, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, one, you see, Songs are, as I was mentioning, the part of the narrative. So, if you, your character is a villager, so you will have to use the language that is acceptable 
uh, that yes, this uh, uh, villager would sing la, uh, tumre bina hamara kaunu nahi. So, theek hai. So, it is the character and it is the ethos of the film that should decide the vocabulary or the diction of the song. So, in that particular film, that was the vocabulary required, and I use that. You see, a competent lyricist may not be a great poet, uh, and I think it's prefer preferable if he's not a great poet. Uh, but what you need is versatility. You have to have a very big repertoire of words and styles because you have to write different kind of songs. You have to write a song of a farmer, song of a street urchin, and a lullaby, and a kawali, and a bhajan, and a cabaret, and a romantic song, and so on and so forth. So every time a romantic song of who? Romantic song of a youngster, romantic song of a professor, and so on and so forth. So, uh, with every character in every situation, your vocabulary should adjust with the character and the situation. So that is how it was required in uh, uh, Lagan. Unlike Joda and Akbar, that was another style. So you had to write another. Then in Rock On, because they are rock groups, so obviously Mary Laundry Kai Bill you have to write, so, and so on. As far as this question is concerned, a friend of mine, Mrs. Uh, uh, Chandra, once told me that I don't believe that you are an atheist. No atheist can write a bhajan like Opalanhare. So I told her that you must be believing that I have been a dacoit also, <laughs> because I have written Gabbar Singh dialogue. <laughs> so when you take a situation, you live with it, you own it, and that time your personal beliefs and personal ideology uh, doesn't work, but the ideology or the feeling or the belief of the character about whom you are writing, for whom you are writing, should dominate you. That's the reason. No, the, I was like, there is another question where, uh, did you feel doubtful about the acceptance? Like, it was like 2000 is coming, the year 2000 is coming, and uh, the whole scene, the, like, India is going through a transition, uh, Amir Khan is doing Y2K and something like that. So, uh, did you feel that this kind of innocence will attract the mind of people, or will this be, uh, will this kind of songs be acceptable? Dikhe. There are two, four, uh, sometimes people ask me, you have written such, so many blockbusters, what is the secret of making a super hit film? You must be knowing something about it. And I tell them if I knew that every time I would have written a Shole. But of course I don't. But I can give you two foolproof ways of making a bad film or writing a bad script or writing a bad song. Two foolproof ways. You won't fail. I promise you. One, that is what these people want. So I'm writing like this. Another, now I want to say something great. These are two foolproof ways of making a bad film, writing a bad script. Because in both the cases, how do you aim? You aim when the target and your eye are in the same line. Only then you will be able to hit the target. In these two cases, either you are shooting up or shooting down. And both the, in both the cases, it's not your eye level. So it can't be right. When Manmohan Desai made Amar Akbar Antony, he made it because this is what he wanted to make. He was passionate about it. He was not making, they will like this. These people, you know, they like this kind of films. He did not make it that cold-bloodedly. He was believing in whatever he's doing. That is important. So, yet, so this question basically is not right that I should think how they will react. Will they like it? No. We should not start. Yes, up to this point, I'm not saying audience or the listener or the reader, not important. Up to this point, am I speaking in a language that this person can understand? Don't change the message. This is my message. I want to say this. I want to make this. How do I communicate with this person? That's about all. But 
if this person will not like what I am saying, sorry, tough luck. But I want to say this. Some people will like it. You see, if you start writing something or making something which you like, so you begin from a positive point that at least there is one person, and that happens to be you, who is liking it. If you start from a point that let me write what these people will like, you never know, they may, they may not, and you are not liking it anyway. So you are starting from a point where nobody is liking it. It's over. Wow. <laughs> Are you, you, you could have spoken on the phone. <laughs> Fighting words and making us all even more lively today. Moving on, the last but the most important session for today, the graduation ceremony. I would like respective HODs to please join us on stage and Mr. Javed Akhtar to please give away the graduation certificates to the outgoing batch. I would request Mr. Arun Bose, sir, HOD of the Sound and Edit Department, to join us on the stage. I would request Adarsh A to please come on stage. Amros A is next requested to please come on stage. <laughs> Balganesh NR is requested to come on stage. <laughs> Bane Manoj Ravind. Choksi Prayagraj Shailendra Bhai are requested to come on stage. <laughs> Harold Aaron S is requested to come on stage. R.V. is requested to come on stage. Kiran K., can you please join us next? Kishore D. Praneet Kumar. Dhat Bose S. Supraja S. Surya Prakash Reddy is not uh, here today. Tejas Joseph Raju, please come on. <laughs> Vishnu C is requested to come on stage. <laughs> Vishnu Vardhan Reddy G is requested to come on stage. <laughs> Thank you both, sir, for joining us today. Next, I request Mr. Saro, sir, to please come on stage. Uh, HOD of our cinematography department. I will request Ajay Bram George to please come on stage. Next would be Anthony Sampson. Next, we would like Arnab Das Gupta to come on stage. We would like Gautami Katwe to come on stage. <laughs> Kuar Amit Vikram is requested to come on stage. Requested to join us on stage. Next would be Rupa G. Krishna on stage. Shish Sabasu is requested to come on stage. That is requested to come on stage.
thank you sir sir for joining us i would request mr sif kumar to join us on stage he is the hod of direction department sir cinderella mary l is requested to come on stage next would be hari ram vs to come on stage we would like jay thakur to come pavan kumar nayak is requested to come on next would be prateek batra on stage please we would like praveen siya to join us on stage next would be shrina sundar swaran to join us on stage we would like sudhir chandran to come on stage we would like udipta datta to join us on vinod kumar m is requested to come on stage last but not the least yukta sudhani thank you sir congratulations you are passing out please collect your refreshments which are available outside our volunteers would guide you out please thank you so much i request all the staff and faculty as well as the passing out batch to stay back for the group photographs thank you everyone for the lovely evening thank you yeah.